No man is above the law. It behooves you to remember that. Hello and welcome back to Civilization VI as Nubia, and as I'm sure you have noticed, things look a tad unusual. And that's because I ended up running into an issue after I updated the game with the game save, or not so much the game save, but every single time I would hit next turn, the game stopped functioning. And it was, you know, just slightly irritating not being able to go forth, so I had to figure out something. And I figured the best way to do it was start the game off right around where I was before with pretty much the exact same settings. The only thing I changed is I took out Harald Hadrada, I think, is the character for Norway. I took him out and replaced him with a... Oh man, I don't remember the other player, Vite. One, one of the new civilizations in East Asia. I cannot remember his name. I don't feel like butchering it. But I added in both of the uh, Far Eastern civilizations as well. So they're also going to be in this one from now on. The builder. Let's get that. Uh, Pikeman. Let's send him north. Crossbowman. Raider. Can't do anything with him. Production. A commercial hub. Ooh, can I... I have 300 gold. Can I purchase? Yes, I can purchase that tile. Let's go with the campus. Eh, go with the campus right there. Research. Yes, I believe at the end of my last video, I was just finishing up scientific theory. So I'm going to go ahead and go with that again. Just to kind of get a similar process going here. I don't recall... I mean, I could go back and look at the video, but I'm not going to do that. What do I need at the moment? Nationalism, declare colonial war. Um, no, no way in hell I'm going to do that. Everybody's starting out in the industrial era, so. Ooh, I can uh, construct a spy, though, for that. Hmm, yeah, I'm going to go with that so I can get a spy. New government, theocracy, monarchy, or merchant republic? Uh, I might go with the monarchy. Actually, I'm going to go with the merchant republic. Oh boy, I have to set up this entire thing. Um, let's see. Oh yeah, decrease unit maintenance. Definitely that. Uh, plus 50% production towards medieval renaissance and me melee and ranged units. I'm going to go with that because I believe Nubia gets a bonus towards producing ranged units. So that'll actually get even more of a bonus. Now, isn't there an economic policy slot that gives my builders more builds? Um, production towards settlers... Is there not even a... Oh, wait. Newly trained builders get two extra build actions. Here we go. Campus district adjacency bonus. Production towards settlers. Man, I should have done all this before I purchased that tile. 
than I could have gone with uh, reduce the cost of purchasing. Hindsight is a bitch. I mean, I don't really have anything yet, so I can't think of much. <laughs> Uh, I'll go with this. Get a little bit of culture for each of my districts. Right now I'll get the one for that after it's built. Okay, and another military policy. What do I want for my empire? Double experience for recon units. Yeah, I'll do defensive building. Confirm policies. Okay, I spent way too long in that. Now I'm sure I'll meet Egypt here any second now. Yeah, and there's Arabia. I am definitely sending my second city up here, without a doubt. Ooh, luxury resource of olives. And trade routes, not available, of course. There's Egypt. بفضل منه الواحد الأحد القوي المنتصر الدائم الذي لا ينتهي ملكه أرسل إليك تحياتي يا صديق العزيز. Alrighty then. Go declare an early war on her so I can steal that settler. It's an honor to meet you. Where's your settler? Oh, don't tell me she settled two cities right immediately next to each other. That's some bullshit if she did. Well, I can do a trade route, so I might as well. And the campus is done. Oh, uh, do a theater square. Theater square. And actually, let's also get a commercial hub down while I'm at it. Or maybe an industrial zone. Get those down. How about an aqueduct as well? No, I'm on a river, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, I'm gonna focus on medieval walls, yes. Next turn. Why the hell not? Did she really just go and plop down a second city right there? It'd be weird. Do I want... No, I don't want a coastal city because I want to be able to get that platinum. So I have thieves now. Oh my god, they definitely did just found a second city right there. Okay, that's pretty damn funny. 
Ooh, nice. I'll get some silver, too. Um, whoa. I got a builder. Well, that's cool. Perfectly fine with that. And production here. The first thing should definitely be an industrial zone. Try and get production up in this city as fast as possible. Oh, wow. Yeah, no, I don't want to harvest it. I want to make use of it permanently, thank you. Ooh, lapis lazuli. Now I feel like I need to get a city over here. And, yep, your people settle too close. Well, I don't plan on settling any more cities right next to you. Since I'm comfortable with having this buffer. Oh, shut up. Ugh. Now I just need to worry about Nzinga, since I know he's going to be filling up the entire part of Central Africa here pretty quick. And I'm going to have him be alert, and you are also going to be alert. Now do I want the horses? Or the food. I'm going to go with the food. Get a little more growth faster. Will I meet Nzinga? I mean, I know I'm going to, but will I meet him in this video? Kind of lame, I have to rediscover everything basically, but. Oh, whoa. Poppies. Oh, there's some aloe. Hey, village. Those are always fi nice to find. Especially if they decide to join my uh, society. Now let's get that niter. that gypsum okay I want that tribal village Egypt you stay away man natural history cool Oh, since I started this game in the industrial era, does that mean there's not going to be any uh, b -b 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 ancient ruins laying around? Or archaeological sites or whatever? No, now I can get renaissance walls. I think I should focus on at least the theater square for now, though. It'll only take two turns, so yeah. Crossbowman, next turn. Okay, where to next? Yeah, let's just keep sending them north, actually, so I can go see what's going on up in Europe. Oh, sandalwood. Cool. And the mountains. Okay. Oh, Carthage. Okay. Yeah, no way of knowing if Sand Support's going to be in here until I go down there. I might not have my uh, city-state friend this time. 
And send an envoy to Carthage. Why not? Okay. So I have five. Does that mean that I sent them six? Oh, yeah. Wow. That's pretty cool. So I'm already there, Cesarean. Very convenient for me. Oh, and there's Valletta. And conveniently enough, I got the Cesarean ship so I can go through their territory now. Next turn. Oh, yeah, why not? Going through the mountains, going up to Europe. That was horribly sung. Moreau, what do I want here in Moreau? The Renaissance walls. I might as well get them up while I can. And I'll keep sending him down. You find Kilimanjaro. Kilimanjaro. Nice, they can embark. Well, yeah, dumb in the industrial area. As it turns out, Mount Kilimanjaro is not Wi Fi enabled. So I had to spend two weeks in Tanzania talking to the people on my trip. Oh god, so horrible. Oh, well, there's Poland. Would you like to visit our city and sample our hospitalities? Where did I see her? Where is she? Oh, she's up here. I'm gonna go find one of her cities. What's this? Cherry tree. And that's a luxury resource too. A harbor. Harbor. That wouldn't be a bad idea. Although it's not like I'm going to be able to get a boat out through there. Unless I constantly have open borders. A water mill. Yeah. Next turn. She wants me to offer open borders for seven gold per turn. I will take that. Goodbye. Oh, shut up. Yeah, she doesn't remember what I did to her in the last two videos, so... I can forgive her. For now. Let's see, who is that? I'm having a hard time reading that. Cordoba? Yep, Cordoba. Geneva! Really? You're weak! Is she gonna try and declare war on me just because I'm weak? Is that how she operates? Does she already have three cities? Damn. Well, the Italian peninsula is still empty. I could go colonize that if I really wanted to. I'm not seeing Zanzibar yet. That's not a good sign. 
Although I have Carthage with me though, at the very least. And they, oh, I don't have Carthage. Damn. Well, that uh, happened pretty fast. Okay, keep going down south. Come on. Let's confirm. Oh my god, did they really? There's bamboo on a mountain. Okay. Interesting. I mean, I guess bamboo can grow on mountains, but... Whatever. Not like I can get up there and make use of it. Yeah, why the hell not? More lapis lazuli. Ooh, what do we got there? Oh, more poppies. Novi sad. Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. Sorry this one had to be a little short, but I got things I got to do. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a thumbs up and share this video. If you want to see more like it, please subscribe to my channel. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, please leave them down below in the comment section. Hope you have a great day and peace out.